Hello and welcome to the Fort Report. I'm Chris Connolly. And I'm Alicia Woodruff. Well, I hate to start out on a negative, but I must tell you there are Steelers in Fort Worth. Weren't they here in February? No, I'm talking about people who make their living preying on others. A huge pet peeve of mine. There's a particular theft that is on the rise. Thieves are stealing copper wire from streetlight poles, resulting in expensive repairs. Not only is this problem wasting money, it's also delaying city response to normal streetlight outages and maintenance. The city is working to stem the tide of these thefts by replacing stolen copper with aluminum, welding access panels shut, and posting signs asking citizens for help to nab these crooks. Some of these criminals have been caught wearing hard hats and reflective vests. But remember, city crews or contractors will always be working out of heavy-duty trucks that have a clearly marked city or business logo. If you see suspicious activity around light poles or traffic signals, call 911 immediately. Residents should also report street light outages as soon as possible at 817-392-8100. And listen, nobody needs to be out there cutting live wires. It's dangerous. I really don't want to know what you do in your free time. So Alicia, I hear that Fort Worth's Finest just completed their latest click it or ticket operation for the Memorial Day weekend. Tell us what they found. Well, unfortunately, some people still don't get it. Fort Worth PD caught and ticketed more than 380 adults wearing no seat belts and found 117 children riding without proper restraint. We hate to crock down like this, but it's the law, people. And it's for your own good. Fortunately, there was no one killed in accidents during the Click It or Ticket campaign, and a life may have been spared thanks to this operation. Buckle up, people. And for crying out loud, buckle up those kiddos. Well, looks like you're ready to go tubing on the Trinity. Yes, and I brought one for you, too. Ha! Now you have a goofy prop. I'm taking my credibility back. This completely cool and completely free event will be held every second and fourth Thursday in June, July, and August. You can grab a friend and plop into the Trinity River from 4 to 8.30 p.m. There will also be live concerts at each event beginning at 6 p.m. The first 600 attendees will receive a free tube, but if you have your own, bring it. The tubing begins at the Panther Island Pavilion in Trinity Uptown. To get more information, visit trinityrivervision.org. Do we really need the goggles? I don't like people splashing me.